Kelly here with Eyes on the Game, and I'm here at Mayweather Boxing Club being joined by Layla McCarter. Now, you just finished a workout. Uh, how How's everything going? Well, everything's great. You know, it's hot in Las Vegas, uh, so it's easy sweat, as they say, but there's nothing easy in boxing. We're, we're having a good time training and uh, getting ready for what's next. Yes, the heat kind of makes it double the work, right? Sort of, yeah. It's very hot. you got to remember to drink that water out there. Yeah. Well, speaking of what's next, um, obviously the historic fight has been announced. Floyd Mayweather, Conor McGregor, August 26th. I know you've expressed some interest on wanting to be on that card. Are there any updates about that? You know, it would be a great thing. I've, I've spoke to Leonard. I've spoken to Floyd about it and uh, haven't got a definite answer on it. You know, um, anything's possible. But um, it looks like the only UFC fighter that they would let cross over would be Conor McGregor, according to uh, UFC's Mark Ratner. But, well, you know, anything can happen. Yes, never say never. Right. You're right. I'd, you know, in any case, I'd like to fight a boxing fight on the same show either way. You know, just to be on that show and that kind of uh, huge event would be a, a great thing for any fighter. And because you mentioned about the UFC and that they may only let Connor kind of cross over for this event only, um, because I know on Twitter you and um, UFC Featherweight, who is fighting for the title later this month or later next month, Chris Cyborg, probably the number one pound for pound women fighter, um, she has expressed interest in wanting to fight you. So what do you make of her call out? Uh, well, actually, I, I mentioned it first. I said, you know, let's do this. And then she she, she, she was interested as well. So, I mean, uh, we're both game to fight. And if she's willing to fight at 147, I know she's walking around about 170 right now. So um, if she can make the weight and we can make the fight, you know, that would be an exciting event because she's one of the best strikers, according to, you know, everybody yes. around the UFC. And um, what a great event that would be. Yes, absolutely. And um, also, she does fight in the featherweight division um, in MMA, so 145. So would you feel comfortable uh, if you guys fought at, you know, 147? Would that be the target weight? That, that'd be fine with me because I've been fighting welterweight. I'm rated number one in the welterweight in boxing. So if she wants to cross over and fight the very best boxer in her weight class in boxing and try her hands, um, I think that'd be a really great event because Connor being the best and crossing over, you know, that'd be a nice compliment to the show. Yeah, and do you think that they should maybe have, you know, one more situation where they have you know, UFC fighter versus boxer, such as yourself and Chris Cyborg? I think it'd be a nice compliment. Also, it would bring more Brazilian fans into the show um, because, you know, she's very popular with the Brazilians. And I don't know how Conor McGregor plays in Brazil. Um, you know, he's an Irishman. He's got a lot of fans in UFC. But I think it would be nice for the Brazilian fans to have somebody to root for as well. And what do you think of the main event? McGregor and Mayweather, how do you see this fight going? No contest. There's no contest, and I, I hate to say it, but Conor McGregor has zero chance, zero chance. I mean, he's fighting the very best boxer in the world in a sport that he's never even had a fight. You know, I, I honestly think, you know, if they can sell it, great, but um, there's going to be a lot of disappointed UFC fans. On that, on that note, being that he's a McGregor, got the Irish name, and I'm a McCarter, you know, I can salvage a few of those fans so they don't have to go home totally sad after Connor loses. I mean, you know, at least one, one Mick will win. <laughs> and great point. Um, how, like, how, which round do you see it going? Um, it depends how hard Connor pushes. If Connor pushes hard, he's going to get knocked out early. Um, you know, he'll do a Ricky Hatton in a sense where he's rushing in and uh, Floyd will have no choice but to counterpunch and he's going to run right into it. You know, Clo Floyd is just a superior fighter to everybody. So, um, yeah, I don't see it going very far if he pushes hard. Now, if he sits back a little bit, you know, and lets Floyd just box, then it could go a, a little bit longer. But I don't see it going 12 rounds. No chance. Um, how soon can we expect to see if you will be on that card? Um, you know, day by day, I'm taking it day by day. I asked Floyd and Leonard to just let me know, and um, hopefully we'll have some news soon, either way. And if, if that doesn't happen August 26th, then I'll probably be getting busy in July. But do you know if Leonard and Floyd are open for you fighting a UFC fighter? 
Leonard expressed an interest when we mentioned it a long time ago that if the McGregor uh, Mayweather fight happens, I said, I'd like to fight the best of the UFC, Amanda Nunez or whoever's on top of the UFC in my weight class at that time. And he said, that's a great idea. I like that. So, you know, um, it, but there's a lot of players in the in the game, you know, a lot of television and um, other promoters to, to worry about. So we'll see what they're interested in doing. And what about Holly Holmes since she comes from the boxing background? I believe Holly Holmes retired. You know, she did her thing in boxing and and in MMA, and uh, I think she's had a great career. I don't I don't see her coming back now. Yeah. So you wouldn't be interested if she came back just for that fight? Oh, I'm interested in any fight. You know, okay. because Holly Holm and I almost fought once in boxing as well, and it didn't happen in, in that time for whatever reasons. And uh, so, so that 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 could be a fight that that is was just delayed quite a few years. Yes. But. Absolutely. And waiting for the most anticipated card, Mayweather versus McGregor, on August 26th. Well, Layla, thank you so much for your time, like always. And we all hope to see you not only fighting soon, but hopefully it will be on that card. Thank you. I hope so as well, Helen. That would be a great, great, great event.